So today we're going to do top three vocal warm-ups by Eric Arsenault. So I will, of course, link the video there, right? So let's keep going. We'll start with the first one. He kind of talks a lot, Eric. You ramble a little. So, so he calls the sniff. So, the sniff. Three parts. Sniff quickly and audibly. Can you see that? Hmm. My ribs just so your ribs should naturally expand. Take off my shirt again. So he says you you should go. I can't see. I gotta watch the. So let's look at this. So supposed to go. Oh, I need to work out, man. But anyway, so it should go. Oh wow, it does expand. And my ribs should naturally respond. Wow. There's no magic number of sniffs because people ask me, like, should it be five sniffs, three sniffs? It's more like the way I think. Oh, it does expand. Wow. It's if let's say you're in your in your bedroom or something and you go, Did someone leave the oven on? Is so it's kinda like Is there you smell something, right? You know how the people do that inquisitive sniff? Like, do you smell that? Is that smoke? You know, it's that it's that kind of sniff. Wow, you can it's good that I'm skinny. That way I can really see it. Right? And not just the sides, but the back of your The back. Which helps so the much back. controlling pressure. This is important for me because if I'm doing a song like, um... So, so while he's rambling, seven, we'll just six, make sure we can see you know, this, like that, right? That's kind of poppy. I, I mess up all the words, I know. But, but if I'm doing something like that, because my voice is natural... It's cold. It's really cold. Okay, it's cold. It's cold. All right, I'm gonna put this back on. It's winter, even though it's LA. It's winter. Ooh. All right. So. Okay, okay, okay. All right. So healthy tension. So let's see. We're gonna keep going and see. So after you sniff, second try. Hold. Not intended. Now traditionally there's a nasal exhale, but I prefer to do it with the hip. So again, this is my first like sit. So if you're familiar with like or somebody like that, like the famous operatic. So sniff. You might know she advocated a hold and then nasal exhale. But I like to do it here because it lets me feel more of my body. Okay. We got this. We got this. I hold, hold, hold. Hold, hold, hold. Hold, hold, hold. And as I'm kissing, you'll notice I don't go. So don't go. Right. Why? Because it naturally activates this. I feel my ass work reflexively. Ooh. This should draw inwards. Okay. I thought we're done with this, but we're going to have to take off the shirt again. All right. We're going to see this. So watch this. Watch this. So. Watch this. So, when I'm warming up, I do not count. Watch this. I know, I might do it three times, I might do it ten times. How do I know I'm ready to sing or ready to move on to the next part? Is this. If I so, it should draw breath, inwards. Okay. So if I let a breath come into my body. So, he's letting a breath. And I feel like the sides and back of my and then ribs swing over. ribs, and cage are just drawing. This, so, right, you don't want a chest back breath. Back so, no. Like, if I get a big belly so, but like. Then I know I'm tight. Again, when we first start like, in the A approach method, we tend to emphasize belly, sides, back, just to get you anchored. Going to the body, just to get more okay. Bent. We want to make you aware of breathing length into the body and having more expression of openness at the ribs. So that should mean that the chest does lift and broaden. The chest is not evil. The side ribs open up. The back ribs open up. So ch chest should, should be balanced by the side and the like back the, ribs. That's you know, the key. Okay. All right, it's too cold, me. Gotta put this back on. But so, I guess um, when you get better at it, it should draw inwards. Then I know I'm good. But if I get a big belly breath or a big chest breath, then I know I'm tired. All right. So I'm warming up my inhale, basically. <sighs> You're warming up your inhale. That's what he just said. Breath can enter my body very freely and easily. 
Oh, that's better. You do. Even though you don't feel like you're making progress. Check this out. Check this out. Oh, wow. I'm getting more breath now. So now I can do that exercise. If you remember. I don't know. So now he's doing the support reflex. A Z, like a zoo, 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 Z exercise. So Z, 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 Z. Paradoxical openness, he calls it. Or he might have to take off my shirt again. Z. Mm. We might have to, we might have to, just to see how it works on the body. So like Z like zoo. Head voice, down to chest voice. Ah, I see. There's a, the problem with z, the problem with z is that if you don't do it right, there's a lot of tension in your throat. So if you go, so you really have to do the, you really have to so sniff, and then hold, and then z, z, z. So it should, your whole body should be responding, which my body's not. Oh, we got to take off the shirt again, unfortunately. So let's go. Let's go. So you sniff. Hold. And then I see. I see. It's really helpful, actually. It's really, really helpful. So sniff. Okay, let's try that again. No tension. Hold. Ah, okay, yeah. Because if you if you really let the body connect, you're not getting any tension here. I see. So it's it's an exercise that's risky. You might hurt your voice, but if you do it right, it, because you might hurt your voice, you have incentive not to hurt your voice, right? So sniff. So. Oh wow, this one is hard. This one's very hard. Anyways, let us put the shirt back on. Man, I'm going to catch a cold now. I'm going to catch a cold if I keep taking off the shirt. Anyways, so so the second exercise is the zzz. I'm going to have to practice that. That's not easy. It's not as easy as the, as the tss, like sit, the tss. So, so, let's see. Hmm. Mm. Resting my jaw. I have a little TMJ problem. So. This one's very hard. Yeah, there's it's not blended at all right now. This one's a little hard. So, so what the third exercise is last part. Vocal frying. Okay. Let me explain something to you. 
if you vocal fry without intending, it's bad. But if you, you have to do it consciously. I know what he's doing. Okay. Yeah. So it is not. Remember, um, vocal fry should not cause tension. Man, my neck is unbalanced. What I'm advocating is a very mindful use of vocal fry. Remove it to strengthen the vocal folds, and believe it or not, to diminish compensatory behaviors. In other words, to reduce strain. So there's a different kind of way I use vocal fry. Nuance is a thing. Okay. So. Soft and my body it should be soft. Why do I love vocal fry so much? By the nature of the sound, you are forced to release breath slowly. You are forced uh, to tap into your natural It releases mechanism. breath slowly. So we could go. Find the core of your tone right. really quickly. It affects muscle memory, posture memory, So the key is not squeeze at all. Uh, you can feel your body responding to abdomen draws in or you might feel healthy pressure sensations in the solar plexus. So you gotta feel it here, I see. It's very good. It brings so much clarity and lightness to the voice. Now, for me, this is just for me. I see. I don't pull fry as high as I can go. I know there are teachers who advocate this. I understand. For my huh. voice. So you should feel it. It's a body thing, right? Excess heaviness of my voice. So, uh, since vocal fry is technically a function of the chest voice, as I move up, uh, it gets clear and I let it. So, uh, um, the key is, so I'm just when I, my head voice is still tight, so you just have to not strain at all. So, it's not It's not that. And if you can't find it, then don't do it. Interesting. Interesting. So what did we learn? We learned sniff, 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 and you feel it in your whole body, right? The body naturally expands. Hold and then go. So that, or. And then, and then go. I'm just having trouble making the Z, so I'm gonna be careful with that. And then the vocal fry. The, uh, uh, just have to not strain at all. Remember, it's the body. So. Uh, if you. Tell yourself it's the body. It's interesting how the vocal fry changes. Okay, remember, use my whole body, right? It's breath control. Very interesting. See, I'm not straining. Huh. All right. So this was Top 3 Vocal Warm-Ups by Eric Arsenault. Um... I like the sniff thing. That'll definitely help. Like, watch this. I think I'm breathing more relaxed after doing this. So. So. So, remember. So, or sniff. Yeah. The more relaxed your body is, like, the more relaxed your neck, your head is, the more when you go, like, sit, you'll feel it here. You'll feel it in this area. So watch this, watch this. Oh, I might need to take off my shirt again. So. Wow, okay. We might have to document this. Man, I'm gonna get a cold. I'm gonna totally get a cold. But check this out. So you go. And then you go. You can literally see it. I mean, you know, I'm still beginner, right? But watch this, you go.
you see it a little bit. You see a little bit. Uh, as I develop these muscles, you'll see it more. You know, I don't have much muscle, but. Oh, sh that's kind of scary. So. I see. Don't do it as fast. So when your body starts connecting, you know you're doing it right. Okay, let's do it again. Wow. Okay, so after you do that, then you go... And you go, zzz, zzz, zzz. So another thing to notice, it's something I sometimes do. You shouldn't be artificially. These should move like naturally. It's like you shouldn't, like when a doctor hits your knee to test that reflex, you shouldn't kick because it's hit, right? It should go naturally. So that's something I have to remember. So you go, zzz, 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 zzz. zzz. Hmm, something like that. I don't know. I still have a lot of tension here, so I'm going to avoid that exercise for now. And let's test out the vocal fry, see if the body moves. So let's breathe in. Uh, 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 oh, wow. You feel it here. Interesting. Okay. Uh, mm, mm, mm. Okay. So now it seems like when I reach head voice, I'm actually using some support here. It used to be at all, it used to be in here. So watch this. Okay. I think these warm ups are pretty good, man. Before I get a cold and before people never watch my channel again because they see my skinny body, I'm going to put this back on. Thank you, Eric. Eric, I might do a few lessons with you eventually once I get more money. So. Thank you so much, everyone, for watching. This was Jerry Sings. If you don't like me taking off my shirt, you should unsubscribe because it really helps me to see how my body moves when I sing. So for those of you watching, thank you. We will be back very, very, very soon.